Bonjour and welcome to this video about French tongue twisters. Today we're going to perfect your French accent and we're going to practice on five French tongue twisters. Um, so let's have a look. Tongue twisters are sentences that are difficult to pronounce, uh, even for native speakers. So we're going to practice them together and start with the first one. So our first French tongue twister is the following. Cinq chiens chasse six chats, which means five dogs hunt six cats. This is a tongue twister that plays with the sh and s sounds. So can you try and repeat after me? Cinq chiens chasse six chats. Again, cinq chiens chasse six chats. Let's try with a bit more words. Cinq chiens chasse, six chats. Let's try the whole sentence now. Cinq chiens chasse, six chats. Again. Cinq chiens chasse, six chats. All right, excellent. Let's look at the second sentence. So, um, let's have a look first. Cinq gros rats grillent dans la grosse graisse grasse, which means five fat rats grill in the big fatty fat. So a bit longer, so let's try word by word first. Cinq gros rats grillent dans la grosse graisse grasse. Okay, let's try. Cinq gros rats grillent dans la grosse graisse grasse. Alright, okay. Cinq gros rats grillent dans la grosse graisse grasse. And now the full tongue twister is Cinq gros rats grillent dans la grosse graisse grasse. Alright. The third twister is a very famous French tongue twister that some natives sometimes struggle. So let's have a look. It says, Les chaussettes de l'archiduchesse sont-elles sèches, archi sèches? Which is in English, the archiduchesse's socks. Are they dry? Very dry. So again, this is a ch, s um, tongue twister. Okay, so let's practice. Les chaussettes de l'archiduchesse sont-elles sèches? Archi sèches. Again. Les chaussettes de l'archiduchesse sont-elles sèches? Archi sèches. Let's try again. Les chaussettes de l'archiduchesse Sont-elles sèches? Archi sèches. And now the full uh, version is: Les chaussettes de l'archiduchesse sont-elles sèches? Archi sèches. Okay. Next one. We have again very popular a uh, chasse tongue twister. So it says. Un chasseur sachant chasser chasse sans son chien. Which means a hunter who knows how to hunt, hunts without his dog. Let's try. Un chasseur sachant chasser chasse sans son chien. Again. Un chasseur sachant chasser chasse Sans son chien. Un chasseur sachant chasser chasse sans son chien. And now the whole tongue twister. Un chasseur sachant chasser chasse sans son chien. Yeah, this is a tricky one. And the last twister that we're going to look at today is the following. Je veux et j'exige du jasmin et des jonquilles. It's a different sounds. Uh, in English, this is 
I want and I insist upon Jasmine and John Quills. So, je veux et j'exige du jasmin et des jonquilles. <coughs> Again, je veux et j'exige du jasmin et des jonquilles. Je veux et j'exige du jasmin et des jonquilles. And the whole uh, tongue twister. Je veux et j'exige du jasmin et des jonquilles. One more time. Je veux et j'exige du jasmin et des jonquilles. Okay, excellent. So we have seen our five tongue twisters. Um, what we'd like to do is for you to come to your French lesson next week and try to recite one of these five tongue twisters to your teacher. You will most likely get some house points um, if you manage to pronounce them correctly. Merci. Au revoir.